Alright, we're going to Celtic Chris H7 here, and I've just got the web app linked to the team here for England, or the Premiership as you can see, but uh, Lambert from Southampton, Championships in it. But anyway, it was out a couple of hours ago, but they didn't get a web app link out for it. Now, there's been a few sort of arguments about people that should have been in and positions, so I'll come to them at the time, but anyway, the first guy is Van Persie, so plays for Arsenal, so I'm sure you all know. And 86 pace, 96 shooting, 86 passing, 91 dribbling, just unbelievable. And I don't even want to predict the prices of um, what uh, these players will go to. I just really don't know, to be honest. But anyway, here we are for a lot, put it that way. Wayne Rooney for Man U. So I'm sure you all know, you'll know everyone in this team. But 88 pace, 95 shooting, 83 dribbling. 91, sorry, 83 passing, 91 dribbling and 87 heading, just an absolute tank. Um, I, I think he's alright in game, I've never played of him, only played of him in FIFA 11, but um, I think he's a really, really, obviously a brilliant card. But I think he's got a 95 team of the year card out, so um, I don't know what that'll mean for his price, but anyway. Antonio Florencio has had a great season for Man U, and 96 pace. Unbelievable. 85 shooting, 90 passing, 90 dribbling. Um, I think he's got four star skills, I'm really not sure to be honest. But an absolute tank of a player, going to be worth. He might actually not be worth that much. I mean, the big players like Van Persie, Rooney, will be worth a lot because they're not going to be pulled as much. But people such as Cole, Chini, Walker, I know the demand will be high for them, but just because of the amount of packs that will be opened, and it depends on how much are going to be released by EA. But anyway, the next guy is Yaya Turi, who's an absolute tank just in real life. And 82 pace, 84 shooting, 92 passing, 89 juggling, 87 defending, 84 heading. So you're going to struggle to get past them, put it that way. I really like him in real life. And uh, he's really good in FIFA as well. So he will be so after greatly just because those stats are unbelievable. And... Yeah, he'll be off quite a bit, to be honest. Probably near enough as much as the strikers. But anyway, David Silva, who's had a really good season, not been as good in the last few months, I think, but he's still been contributing in the last few games, obviously. Um, still up to win the title, but 82 pace, 85 shooting, 95 passing, 93 dribbling. Just all, every player on this team's an absolute tank, but he, look, he looks really good as well, and is pretty high rated as well. So, Gareth Bale, who's had another fantastic season for Tottenham, 96 pace, 88 shooting, 89 passing, 93 dribbling. Really good. I think he's a really good player in the game. I've played, I've played with him back in sort of November and he was really good, so he is a really good player. Now moving on to the next guy who I will be getting for my team, uh, Leighton Baines. Leighton Baines, who plays for Everton. So, 82 pace, 82 shooting, 85 passing. 82 dribbling, 87 hit, defending, absolute tank again. And actually when the, I saw this, I had to sell Walker and Kabai straight away. And actually an auto buy, I got them and I only lost about 10k. So that wasn't too bad. But moving on to the next guy who is Vincent Company, Another um, player that I really like in real life. So 75 pace, 77 pass, 95 defending, 92 heading. Uh, I'm not too sure, I think it's 72 pace on his uh, sort of normal card, he's, so they could have maybe put that up to 77, but anyway, he's an absolute tank as well. But it looks as if he'll be really good at getting the ball out of defence as well, really good to have a defender that's got pretty good passing, just to get the ball out. But Colchin is another one who's got pretty decent passing, overall really, really great stats, 70 pace, 75 passing. 70 dribbling, 93 defending, 89 heading. Just fantastic, to be honest. Had it, had it in form already. One of the players that I sold straight away as soon as I saw this Walker, 94 pace, 77 shooting, 81 passing, 83 dribbling, 85 defending, 80 heading. Just unbelievable, to be honest. And going on to Joe Hart, who's had a fantastic season for Manchester City. Won them a lot of points, 91 different. 91 diving, 94 reflexes, 87 positioning. Um, a bit surprising that only three of his stats are really sort of outstanding. Um, but he does, he's an absolute great player. It'll be interesting to see what his price is actually. 
Um, I guess I might get him. But moving on to the next, uh, on to the bench, sorry. If Hart's too much, I'll be certainly getting cruel. An 88, I have an 82 hand on, 89 reflexes, and 82 positioning. See for an 84, 82, I look at those stats, and then for four stat points higher. You know, when you look at every stat, um, obviously Krill's worth, worse off than a lot of them, but he's not wor worse off by sort of that much. So, moving on to Williams, who plays for Swansea. 70 pace, it's 83 de defending, 86 heading, 75 passing. Really good season for Swansea, really enjoyed watching them this year on and a half. And, yeah, so moving on to Kabai, who are another player that I really like in real life. 90 passing, 80 pace, which is really good Good to get his pace up around 80. 87 shooting, 86 dribbling, 83 heading. Just, again, another great player that I'm going to be buying definitely. Dempsey, Quint Dempsey, has had a brilliant season. Now, he could be changed to a CAM or a striker from what I'm hearing. So, just wait and see. 82 pace, 92 shooting, 92 heading for a left midfielder would be a bit odd. But anyway, really great player and I would quite like him to go to a striker to be honest. Now Mata, who could be changed to a CAM. So 87 pace, 82 shooting, 93 pass, 93 dribbling. And if I go down the route of having a Spanish CAM, which is pretty possible, then I'm going to see how these two play in, play in game as to which one I get. So moving on to the next guy who's Aguero, Man City, another player that I really like in real life. So 90 pace, 95 dribbling, 94 shooting. I've had him before and he's an absolute tank of a player. So moving on to that last player who's Ricky Lambert of Southampton. So coming up to the Premiership next year, 80 pace, 88 shooting, 71 passing, 76 dribbling, 87 heading. Unbelievable. Uh, well, not unbelievable for an 84 rated, but um, when you look at the rest of this team, just absolutely brilliant. Probably trying to get, I'll, I would like to buy company just to play with them. Um, Baines. Baines will definitely be getting Walker, one of either Krull or Hart and Kabai. So, we're getting quite a few players from this team, whatever place they are. Obviously, nothing um, out of this world, but I don't think they'll be um, going after sort of put prices that I think they'll be in. that's what I think I'll get them for so good luck getting them in packs if that's what you're going to do but um, if you pull one of these at any point in the next week you're going to be looking at or well, maybe not Williams or Krill um, but you're going to be looking at at least 50k plus and um, but um, maybe not but you're going to be looking at at least 50k plus in my opinion so um, good luck opening packs and I'm just about to do team of the week so that's why this the team of the year one's a bit shorter as well team of the week but just going on to the Team of the Week now, so this will be uploaded separately and I'll see you for the Team of the Week video. Hope you enjoyed.